To, to summarize, the short message endings of Silent Hill are more than just conclusions to a game. They are profound reflections of the human condition, delving into themes of guilt, redemption, obsession, and truth. In Silent Hill 2, the in-water ending encapsulates the cyclical nature of suffering, while Silent Hill 3's never-ending cycle ending reminds us of the enduring grip of past horrors, the mother ending in Silent Hill 4. The Room explores the dark side of love and obsession and Silent Hill Origins UFO ending subverts expectations with its surreal humor. Lastly, Silent Hill Shattered Memories Smile Ending challenges our understanding of reality and identity. Each ending is a testament to the series' psychological depth and narrative complexity. They force us to confront the darkness within ourselves and the realities we choose to accept or deny. And that, fellow adventurers, is the true horror and brilliance of Silent Hill. In the end, these intricate endings serve as a mirror, reflecting back at us our deepest fears and desires. They remind us that in the fog-shrouded town of Silent Hill, we are not just fighting monsters but wrestling with our own inner demons, and perhaps that's the most terrifying revelation of all. So until the next time, remember, Silent Hill is not just a game, it's a journey into the soul, a labyrinth of the mind that challenges, scares, and ultimately illuminates. Until then, keep venturing into the unknown, keep questioning your reality, and most importantly, keep playing.